And we're on another site here in Pennsylvania. And just want to show you guys some usage of wire tray, wire basket. So we're just roughing it in now. Demo, of course, is going through. So how do we get across open ceiling? So we have our poles sitting in service coils waiting for cubicles. But um, basically, wire tray, cable tray, wire basket. There's like three different names in the industry for that. But basically, they come in 10-foot sections. You secure it to the ceiling, clamps. Um, and then in between every 10 foot section, sometimes you can get them like 12 foot. Um, you just put clamps on there, um, lock them together. So, and then there's some other great ideas with waterfalls coming down. Um, sometimes we'll cut out some of the tray and we'll actually have what's called a waterfall so that the cable stream doesn't go, just go directly through. Some short ends. And keep in mind that we're roughing in fire alarm, access control. You know, this for budgetary reasons, if you just have a couple J hooks, um, not a big fan of that. However, I just wanted to show you guys examples of different things. Now that was an outside vendor, by the way, um, put a blue cable in. We're talking to the general contractor about removing that too, because I just don't like it. But anyway, um, you have these white clamps that aren't J-hooks. Um, they are Arlington's and they work wonders. I like them. Um, they're just simple clamps, so you can just go up on there. And of course, we're just pulling slack right now, getting it all together. Um, we kind of jumped the gun a little bit and we know that we don't have to pull slack on this bundle, so we just wire tied it. So, uh, excuse me, not wire tied it, Velcro. So but that's about it on an open ceiling suspension. And then of course it goes into a beautiful server room.